taking a break from work because I just got in the mail and it was my birthday. So of course I have stuff. This is courtesy of a good friend of mine. Hi, Cal. Who got me a gift card. Not expected, not required, but appreciated. And where did he get it from? Jet pins. So, I think I got two things. Let's see if I remember that right. They did well fitting this in the box. Cal? That's for you. I did get two things. Model of restraint. So the first is this ink. And I gotta say, these are two things that it's kind of like I had been eyeing, but then I felt like, Maria, you shouldn't get that because reasons. Um, note that I went over the amount. But it doesn't matter, the impetus, the impetus for it was the birthday. It's fine. So I got this ink called Yamabudo. It is beautiful. I have a sample of it and love it. And it, it's the color is supposed to be wild grapes, which feels appropriate because of my longstanding affection for wine. These bottles are amazing. Look at them. And it's got that little divot in the bottom right here that actually makes filling it easier. I'm excited about this. And I can't wait to use it, even though I've used it before. Shh, 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 shh. Okay. And then the next thing I got, which I needed... I was, I have, like, here's what you don't understand. In this house, there is a critical shortage of this item. Critical. Like, you're going to, you're going to ask yourself, how do they even function? And by they, it's just me. I don't know why you think there's more than just me. But how can this household even function with this lack? Right? Like, whoa, I'm surprised they're still living. I don't know. I got a pen! Yay! That one's free too, Cal. So, it's another Twisby. I'm slowly getting collection because I like their pens, it turns out. And they're actually pretty inexpensive. And this one is a special edition. And it's a pin I didn't have. I hadn't tried this model. So this is the Eco T divisive in the fountain pen community. Oh, it's tape on the ends. Because, <coughs> excuse me, the T stands for triangular because it has a triangular grip. And some people really hate that. So the my um, one of my first pin loves, and I still love it, is the Lamy Safari, and it has a triangular grip. I'm considering also getting a Lamy All Star because I like my I have well my first was the Lamy Vista, which is the demonstrator, the see through model. Anyway, and I don't have the All Star, and so like the completionist in me is like, but you could get the All Star. Um, anyway, so here we're opening it up. All right. And then there's some directions on like how to do stuff. And then that was uh, more directions on how to do stuff. I think specifically how to fill it. And then, boo, 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 the pin. So it comes with a wrench and it comes with a little vial of silicone grease. And then this is saying, oh, 
I suppose I'm not supposed to drink before I operate this pen. It says no alcohol. Whew. Well, mine doesn't count. Anyway, here it is. It's lovely. So the camera is making it look darker than it really is to my eye. It's a fair, which is fascinating because I actually kind of like that color in there better than this color, but this is still beautiful. It's a really pale pastel mint color. Um, I got it with, to the surprise of no one, a broad nib because I really like the fat lines that they put down. This pen has a little piston filler and I'm gonna pause this real quick, clean it out, and we're gonna fill it with ink. Yes, you guys, I bet you you're never gonna guess what ink I'm filling it with. And we're back. And here's the ink I'm filling it up with. I'm probably right that you weren't gonna guess because you thought I was being silly and suggesting it would be Yamabudo, but it's not. Well, let me get my ink a pet. I'm just gonna fall over. Whew, that was close. There you go, little buddy. So I rinsed out the pen. There's water in there now. Now I'm gonna stick it in here. Suck up the ink. Push the ink back out. Suck up the more ink. Mm -hmm. Wipe off the outside. I did not get the greatest fill ever, but it's actually kind of not surprising because I don't know. I never do. And I don't really care. I got in here parrotfish. So we're going to look back at what that looked like. That's this guy. Parrotfish. You can see the sparkle in there. Maybe. I'm just knock it back around. And then this is where I write down what inks I put into things. But I think there's one I didn't write down that I did. All right, what's today? I don't know, 328, give or take, 22. This is my Twiz B Eco T Brad. And then demons parrotfish. So we're gonna do our little lines. And I wish I had done the first ink have that be that poo color. Oh, I also like this. I don't love it on all of them, but these two colors together are nice, eh? I think so. And look, he kind of matches my little Inca pet. But look at this. Hold on. Can we just talk about what a good job I did matching ink to pen? Right? Hold up. That's real good. Especially if you look at it here. Good job. Well done, me. So that's the stuff I got. Um, we'll pretend that I don't have other packages on the way, and then when they get here, we'll be surprised. Um, I don't know when they're going to get here. One's coming from Turkey. What? Very excited about that. It might be more ink. But anyway, who knows? It doesn't matter. Things will happen. They'll show up. It's going to be great. Uh, thanks again. Thank, especially... Thank you to Cal for the birthday gift. Hi, everybody.